Hi everyone, I'm Jay and I'm here at the Justin Rose Golf Academy. Today I'm going to show you how to use Top Tracer to learn how to manage your game. So do you have a go-to shot that you know you can hit under pressure and when you're not quite striking it well? So for me personally I like to hit a punch shot and that involves putting the ball in the back of the stance and feeling a much shorter backswing and a much shorter follow through because I know that that's going to be repeatable when I'm feeling under pressure or when I've not quite got my A game that day. So once you know what your go-to shot is, you can then use the top tracer to identify how far that shot's going with a particular club. So I'm going to select the warm-up feature to figure out how far my go-to shot goes with a 7 iron punch shot. Okay, so with a punch shot, you want the ball position further back in the stance. You want to feel more weight on the front leg and feel as though the backswing and the follow through are a little bit shorter than normal. And imagine you're hitting down on the ball and compressing it. It should look a little bit like this. Okay, so my normal carry distance full swing is 145. The top tracer is now telling me that my carry distance with my go-to punch shot is 140. So having gained that knowledge, I can go out into the golf course and I know my carry distance for my go-to punch shot with a 7 iron. Now I'm going to proceed to go through my entire bag and figure out the carry distances for every shot with a punch shot. 